Popcurrent's exclusive sponsor is Bakersfield Heart Hospital. Happy Friday and welcome back to Popcurrent. I'm Nicole Gitsky. Well, Kern County is officially in the red tier, and what does that mean for us? Well, it means a lot more fun and a lot more is opening up right here in our county. So how about we go check it out and have some fun? Our first stop brings us to Boulevard and we are joined by Elsie. She is the Director of Marketing and Sales. And what's so exciting is you guys are reopening. Tell yes. us all about it. We are so happy to be back. What is it like, you know, to finally reopen and allow people back? We're just excited to let people honestly to come back to a safe place and just have fun. Like adults, children, everybody, they just want to get out of their house and go enjoy some family fun. And it's very safe here how we're doing everything. So talk about that. Talk about all the COVID restrictions in place right now. So actually all of our employees are getting vaccinated. We are going to have only 25% capacity. Um, and we'll, on the bowling lanes, we'll do like every other lane. We have hand sanitizer everywhere. Everyone's going to be wearing face masks, being down, everything, sanitizing everything constantly just to make sure everyone is safe. We also have like little plexi glasses um, on our bowling counters as well. Everything's very spread out in general already, yes. which really worked out for you guys. Just an example, there's a hand sanitizing station right there. So as we soon as you're done, everywhere. you can, you know, make sure that you feel, just get some, you know, hand sanitizer. So onto the next game, everything's very clean and safe. So it's definitely a safe place if people yes. want to come out. You know, you guys have been operating with your outdoor patio. How has that just been, you know, through everything? It's been tough. We've only done the patio, I believe, for like three weeks. But I mean, you know, people want to come inside. They want to come inside and bowl. They want to do it with the arcade. And outside, we, our capacity is super small right now. And we only have like three games out there. So it's been tough, um, but we're excited to be open now. I think what everyone, you know, is kind of almost desperate for is just to do something different, to yes. get out. And what's awesome here is you guys kind of offer everything. You can eat here, mm -hmm. you can drink here, you you can go Games, bowling, you can, yes. yeah, exactly. You can do all these things while it being really safe and you don't really have to worry. Our next stop brings us over to Studio Movie Grill and we are joined by TJ, the general manager, and you guys are opening on Friday. Tell us all about it. Oh, finally, finally. We've been doing to-go's for a long period of time with my managers and myself and it's, it's, a, it's a blessing. Finally, we have an opportunity Friday at 3 o'clock. The doors are opening up. Uh, we're excited to start uh, seeing movies. Um, I'm, I'm thrilled to death. It's, it's been waiting such a long time. Now, walk us through what people can expect are going to be different and what's going to be the same here with all the COVID precautions in place. Well, obviously, we, we're doing everything by CDC guidelines. Um, when they walk through the door, uh, everything will be spaced out. As you will see, the pink, we do this, the six foot distance social distancing. The cool thing now is that we've uh, we engineered in our system, so if you go to the kiosk and you buy a ticket, come to the movies. Um, your seat's are already assigned, your movie's are already assigned, you can now get your food and your drinks through the kiosk. It'll pop up, once you get set, the drinks and food go to the actual uh, bar and kitchen, they make it, they send it to you. So it's just one less step if you don't want to do that. If you want to go and grab uh, tickets at the front, you can do that. If you want to sit down and have a server take care of you, by all means, we'd love to have that happen too. We're just giving some other options for everybody. I think people are just desperate to do anything right now. Everyone you know has been cooped up in their homes for over a year now. This is just a chance to get out, do something different. Everyone's been watching movies on their own home TV, but it's never the same as a movie theater experience. You know, everybody talks about the streaming and you know, that it's gonna go ahead on TVs first and we all know. There's nothing better to come to our theater, to sit down in a nice comfortable chair, to be taken care of or waited on with foods and drinks along with popcorn. Nothing better, come on, popcorn made here, nothing, nothing compares to that. What are some of the movies that people can catch here? Well, this week, and like I said, the week we have right now, we have a couple of good movies for families. We have Tom and Jerry, uh, we have Rhea and The Last Dragon. Those are great kid movies to come see. We have Nobody which is coming out. We have The Marksman, which I know it's a movie that's been out, but again, you've seen it in the theater. So these are, um, these are some good movies to come and see. And like I say, the best part, Godzilla versus King Kong. Oh. Tickets go on sale right now for Wednesday, and you can buy them. Now, you know, I feel like the movie theater business has been hit really hard amid the pandemic. You guys back in June opened for six days. 
then had to shut back down. You've been closed since. What are you looking forward to the most? Uh, the faces of walking in here excited, the families, everybody happy to, to get out of their house, to finally sit down and watch a beautiful movie, enjoy themselves, uh, get some incredible service. Um, it's been so long. I mean, just getting out of the house alone is a blessing. So I'm excited to see that. Now, what does this mean for us in Kern County? Well, we could very soon be seeing the orange deer. That means a lot more would be opening up. We will know that in about three weeks from now. In the meantime, enjoy that we are going to have some more businesses open and support local as much as you can. These businesses really have been struggling. That's it for us here at this top Kern. We'll catch you next Friday at noon.